G'day, g'day. G'day. Welcome back to another vlog. Oh, can we show them this that I just got sent? <laughs> sure. Diane's going to show you our hashtag gifted on, Honestly, on this no, channel it's instead of her own. Best smelling perfume I've ever smelled. Hashtag gifted, but not to me, to Diane. To me. Like, I smell so good. Floral scent. Um, it smells like flowers. And it's a Van Gogh. Van Gogh picture on the front. Fragrance owned by flowers. Just if you if you do fancy a good perfume, anyone out there looking for one, recommend Floral Street Sunflower. What Cross. is this? There you go. Do you know what? From, from living with Diane, I've I, I've come to realise. I, mean, I shouldn't. I knew this anyway from from being around my sister. The amount of things girls get gifted mm -hmm. compared to boys. I don't want to start like a debate in the comments, although feel free to. But I'm just putting it out there. Girls get sent so many more um, hashtag gifteds than boys do. I had a biscuit company reach out. Well, that's all I get offered, biscuits and things like that. I had a biscuit company reach out and say, we want to send you like a lifetime supply of biscuits. And they were clearly trolling me because it's been like a year now and I've not seen any biscuits. Before you even ask, it's not custard creams either. Because there's more, there's more stuff for girls, isn't there, out there? I guess so, yeah. There's more products and things that girls like and share. But, hey. Oh well, rant over. We're, uh, we're waiting on an important phone call. If you get it today, you're going to be very, very happy. If we don't get it, then it's going to be a real shitter. Stinker. A real shitter. Um, so hopefully our phone will ring. Now! Now! Do you used to play that game? I used to play I own. What's that? Where you sit in the car. Yeah. And you have a boy on one side and well, my brother on one side. And, my other. and on the side that you drive, so you're driving along and you got to go, I own whatever you pass. I own Joe Sug. I own this lemon curd candy. <coughs> You, you bought this for me. Did I? Yeah. Bugger off. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. You brought this. Bugger off. You brought this. For, can you remember where you bought this for me? With yeah, the, the lemon shop. No, yeah, we I know. Were with... We were Zoe and Alfie in Next. Yes, and you bought this for me. <laughs> Do you know how I knew that? Because it says Next on top of the candy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, well true. saved. Yeah. Well saved. Of course I remember. But anyway, whatever this vlog's going to turn into, I hope you enjoy it. I'm sorry, Matt. Oh, God. I don't know why I'm so bored. Oh. It was a stick, oh. is it? Smells like, um, like burnt tyres and, like, um, and, um, Well, I just, drains. Had, I just had a green tea. Yeah, burnt tyre and drains. We've got a race on our hands. We've got two chests of drawers to build. This one. This one. And one over there. And that one. I, you can open this one because it actually is very annoying to open. Do you know what? I prefer that because knowing you, you've already opened that one. There's going to be bits, bits missing and just True. not in order. But I'm literally going to be following you. It's so. going to be very much uh, messy and fast versus <laughs> neat and slow. Yeah, but I don't know what to do, so I have let's to see, follow you. Let's see who, uh, who comes out on top. I love how you said it's a mission to open, look. With a pair of scissors. It's so annoying, everything you do just works. <laughs> but the thing, Diane, even... Even... At your age, you've not quite worked out how to open parcels properly. No. Like, whenever a parcel arrives, Diane will just tear it from whatever end she holds first. She won't be like, okay, here's clearly the opening, which will make things a lot easier. She rips boxes, like just rips chunks out of boxes and doesn't actually open them properly. So already I'm onto a winning start. Um, have you seen this show on TV, The Toys That Made Us? Yeah. Have you seen it? I've not properly watched it, but I, yeah. How cool is that? It's amazing. It is really cool. She put it on. Mm. <laughs> it's amazing, but no, I don't want to watch it. Yeah. It's like Christmas Day. Oh my god, it is. If he worked in a a pine shop. My granddad used to work in a pine shop. Yeah. Chippy? Yeah. Yeah. That's not why it's called Chippy, but that's why um, he used to work in a pine shop. So he would be looking at this thinking like, this is not good enough quality. Yeah, I know, that's quite cute, isn't it? But, don't get your pile mixed with my pile. Sometimes I feel like I've... 
have somehow. Sometimes I feel like so to throw my hands up in the air. I, I find this stuff very therapeutic. Very brilliant. So now you can do that one. You'll no, be but... you'll be so zen for the rest of your day. He's clearly won the race because that's see, mine over there. I want to see you do yours. I no. See yours looks like. It's really annoying as well though. Who's the company that made this? I'm, I'm gonna, gonna I'm gonna order some more stuff because I want our insane. other room done. Vida, Vida Designs Furniture, you've you've done us over here, look. Look, one, this of, the, one of the back panels <laughs> is missing. Is that not the back panel? No, that's a drawer panel. I've looked everywhere. In the boxes, everywhere. There's not no, that not there? That that's the two panels for the other one. So one of them has got a missing back panel. Hmm. So either send it in the next week, otherwise. I'm leaving this in the edit. <laughs> How will they know until it goes out in the video? Yeah. Do you think I should paint them? Uh, I think so. It's up to you. I mean, that's kind of a stupid question because you're just going to paint them anyway. Yeah, 100%. Job done. One down. Let's see how Diane got on. Ah. <laughs> but do you know what? I've realised that this is probably all part of our plan. Our plan was to be like, yeah, let's do a race. Let's do... Let's do uh, me versus you in terms of flat pack, you know, follow me along, you do it, I'll follow. And she's tricked me. She's left it all and then she knows now that I, I can't just leave that there in the lounge, it'll look too messy. So I've been tricked. Done. So I managed to finish this before the album I was listening to finished, which is good. So I did it in under an album. You beauty. Every single day this week when I've come into this room, it's been rearranged. Like, where's that come from? Where's this plant come from? Like everything has just changed round. I swear, I feel like I'm going crazy, but I'm not. Diane's definitely been in here every day. She comes down, makes her breakfast, does a workout or whatever, and then decides to completely rearrange the entire room. I'm gonna quickly eat my dinner, and then we're gonna watch the one show, because tonight they're announcing the first three celebrities for this year's Strictly Come Dancing. It's that time of year already. That's scary. One. Show with Alex Jones. And look, now we haven't seen him in far too long. Like, when you no. presented this, <laughs> yeah. it's a good night. <laughs> <laughs> you were so cute. Yeah, I shut my pants. Yeah, you were nervous as well. Three contestants for Strictly Come Dancing 2021. I literally can hardly contain myself. Sing it! Hello, Alex! As you can see, one of the Strictly contestants is already sitting in. Someone from McFly? Or oh, busted. Or couple with his wife. Giovanna. It's Tom! Tom Fletcher! Tom Fletcher! Including this one. Oh it's my god! Tom Fletcher! Yeah! Schauspieler, actor, and comica. It is the best of point from David Mitchell. Music and comedy double act. It is. <gasps> no, it's not. That's pretty obvious. It no, it's not. We We've been watching Peep Show. We have been watching Peep Show. <gasps> I mean, I've already watched it like 15 times, but. incredibly successful Peep Show. It is, of course, author, comedian, and actor Robert Wayne! Yeah! Oh, you can spin! He can dance! He can spin! Why not let her intro herself? A singer. I was born and raised here in Blackburn. Oh my god! I know it because she was on my podcast. Yes! It's AJ. She's gonna be amazing. Yay! AJ's back on strict AJ! <laughs> Yay! She's gonna be amazing. All the way to the Strictly Dance Floor, it is, of course, AJ and Yay! 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 She's so nice. Yes! <laughs> yes! What yes! A, she's brilliant. She is brilliant. So that's the first three announced. That's it. It's begun. It's begun. It started. Yeah, so. Good rabbits chasing each other in the garden. Oh Pack it in. But why do you smell of garlic? You've been, in, you've been in garlic clothes again. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, there's still, I think, still other people to go. That's the thing. I can't make the prediction just yet. I might wait until. Do you know what? I think I'm going to wait until everyone's announced. Yeah, and do your prediction. And then I'm going to do 
a whole thing just on my predictions, I think. I'll do that instead. Too early, I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna wait. Now you're probably thinking, Joe, I'm bored sick to death of seeing you wear the same hoodie for the last probably five years on YouTube. Do you ever actually own any of the clothes? The answer to that is no, no I don't. But I've done my annual ASOS shop. I only get one a year. Um, but, oosh, it's a big, it's a big one. I remember when I ordered it, I said I was annoyed myself that I'd, that I'd got it. I've got a photo shoot coming up to, to, to get some headshots uh, and various things. I think it's for headshots anyway. I think it's headshots. So I probably don't really I need clothes. No. So this could be a, a massive waste. Um, I am getting my hair cut, which I'm very excited about because I've not seen Kieran in forever. So I'm excited to get the crown sorted and um, for him to repair the damage that Diane's done. I mean, to, to, for him to have a go at doing my hair. Excuse me. Uh, I haven't got a stylist or a makeup artist, so I'm going to do. I'm going to borrow some of Diane's powder, and I've supplied my own clothes. I think I'm going to get ten photographs out of it. So I wanted to chuck a few fashiony ones in there. So I've, I've bought a little few bits and bobs, and thought I would do um, an ASOS haul. And it's been try on haul. Is that the yeah. new one? Is it? Is it try on haul? Is it? Yeah, you're going to try it on. Really? Yes, yeah, so I can see it. Okay. Well, let's open this. Let's open this up. It really was a big one, right? Okay. First up, we have some Reeboks. I'm actually a big fan of Reebok shoes. Funny enough, I always they're like my go-to at the moment. My go-to slip-on shoes. Um, the ones I have have been used to death. They're now covered in mud and like sheep poo and cow pat and stuff like that. So I thought I'd treat myself and get some new ones. We've gone for some of these. These are, I, mm, mm. I do like these. Simple white Reeboks. They're a bit, they're a bit tennis shoey. The athlete shoe. What was this one? We've got, yep, yeah, it's soft. It's past the softness test. We've got a soft jumper. I thought, that could be used in a photo shoot, right? That's a sort of photo shooty kind of jumper. It looks cozy. I think it's, oh, do you know what? I think it's a linen shirt. I don't really like the feel of linen, but I like the pattern on it. So that's why I went for it. But I'm not sure about the pattern. Has, oh my God, it's got, I didn't realize it's got camper vans on it. It's got camper van on it. But that is a holiday shirt if I ever did see one. I don't know how it would look, but I think, I think I'm quids in here. I'm happy with that. Next up, we've got a plain, I have no plain white t-shirts anymore. This is kind of not quite plain, it's from New Look. But it's like a, it's got a waffle effect on it. Bit different, but I like it. We've got this hoodie, which I like. It's a vintage looking hoodie. It's got oranges on it. And it's got oranges on the back. I like oranges. That's a real beach hoodie, that one. Happy days. I think, I think, no word of a lie, I genuinely think I own two pairs of jeans at the moment. So I'm about to have four because I've got this pair of jeans, which I'm hoping is my size. I find getting the right size in jeans, you guys have seen my legs on, on YouTube plenty of times. I have the tiniest sparrow-like legs. So it's really hard to find jeans that actually complement my legs, if there is any jeans possible that complement my legs. Um, and look all right. So I'm, I've had to go real baggy nowadays. And these are a baggy pair of jeans and they look massive. These are baggier than I thought. I've got another pair of jeans. Similar sort of jeans, but way shorter. Way shorter! Um, and more tapered off at the end. And a sort of more, less light denim -y color. Happy with that. I think that, yeah, they smell all right. I think, they're the, I think that's the winning pair. Oh, this is a nice silky one. It's a nice silky shirt covered in letters. Do you know what, this shirt was quite expensive. Um, Cause it's a Ralph Lauren shirt. A bit more expensive this one, but I'm hoping the more you pay, the better the quality. And I was right because this shirt feels incredible. I've been told to wear more green because apparently it brings out the color in my eyes. That's exactly what I've gone and done. I've got myself a green Ralph Lauren shirt. Who does he think he is? But it does feel soft. This is gonna be my Sunday, my Sunday shirt. Is it, is it doing it? it? Should bring out the color of my eyes. Look. 
And that's all I've got. I'm gonna try them on now and pack my bag for tomorrow um, and also show Diane the outfits and see what she thinks. Um, you will see them, I'm sure, in upcoming vlogs or the pictures, if they're any good. I'll share them on Instagram, Joe underscore suck, make sure you follow me. Um, but I'm gonna end the vlog there. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, really looking forward to finding out who the rest of the contestants are on Strictly. Um, I will be doing a uh, trying to guess who's gonna go with who before the, uh, before the pairing actually happens. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. And as you've seen in the previous vlog, Wild Things, the single, is out next Friday, which is uh, it's huge. Um, so if you haven't already, please go down and click the link and pre-save or pre-order. Um, I think it's like 70 cent P. Um, if you would do that, it would mean the world. Um, and I'll love you forever. Take care. See you soon. Bye.